What is going on you guys? It's Jeremy here and I'm coming to you on this wonderful Saturday as always. Just wanted to take a break from being inside. I'm preparing for TR students tomorrow morning. I'm giving the word as we wrap up our Fear and Faith series. So I hope to see you there at 11.30. We are on for an awesome, awesome time. God's given me such an amazing word. So I'm excited to be bringing that tomorrow. But I just wanted to give you guys a couple quick things to think about as we prepare for the week ahead. And from our conversation on Wednesday, we've been talking about fear and faith, as you guys know. And uh, just to keep encouraging you guys that, you know, whatever passions you have, whatever it is that you enjoy doing, whatever it is that you feel like there's, there's life on, whether that be sports, whether that be music, spending time with family, I know you guys have so much that you get to be a part of. And I would encourage you to put God at the very center of whatever that is and see what he would do. Like the example I gave of, uh, we just had our student takeover Sunday, where a lot of you guys got to be on stage or helping out or doing all these amazing things. You know, God wants to put you in amazing places to show you guys off just how creative you are, just how awesome you are, to bless people, but also to bless you. And so I even want to give you encouragement that God is going to accelerate and put you guys into places that I could never go. For instance, one of our very own, Ryan Smith, is out at the Scripps National Spelling Bee right now as I record this video. He is out there spelling his way to the top. I believe he's going to be an absolute champion. He's going to dominate the field. He's going to do an amazing job. I'm so proud of Ryan, and I hope you guys will encourage him, will reach out to him. And I just want to give you a little bonus for those of you guys like me who are not able to go to the Spelling Bee, but if you can tell me what speller number Ryan is, I will give you a prize next Wednesday. If you text me before then or uh, let me know by Wednesday night, I will have a prize for you guys as well. But just encourage and love on him and just be encouraged that what God can do for Ryan, he can do for you. And as he's putting him on stage to do an amazing job, I believe he's going to do the same thing for you guys. So don't be surprised if God does unexpected things in your life. I know that he can. I will see you tomorrow morning for an amazing service and I hope you guys have a great rest of your Saturday.